Hey yo peeps, my name is Pablo Picanto. Welcome back to Her Story. So, in the last episode, we found out that uh, Simon's death was uh, covered up by our suspect here. Let's see if we, this time, can find out how he died, how he was killed. Okay, let's see... Let's see, Simon dead. That's all that matters, really. The baby. Simon's dead. But the baby... That's how he will live on. Our baby. Oh, our baby. So she and her sister... Killed Simon, right? To keep the baby... And to share the baby, maybe? It was supposed to be a secret. Just because Simon is dead, it doesn't mean I have to give mm. up all his secrets. It doesn't have anything to do with what happened to Simon. No one murdered my husband because he cheated his expenses for a romantic weekend in Oxford. In Oxford? Oxford, okay, let's... Like I said before, it was three, something like that. <clears throat> I walked in, saw Simon, he was on the floor of the living room. His throat had been cut. There was a lot of blood. Yeah, he was dead. Blood. Okay, so she is Simon's wife, I guess. <clears throat> the one who lost her baby, then her sister came, had a romantic time with Simon in Oxford. In Oxford and got pregnant. Then she killed Simon and. There was a conference. Something to do with double glazing. In Oxford? In Oxford. And he went there and he met her sister. Are you sure? Hannah's sister. What would he be doing in Oxford if there was no conference? <clears throat> no conference. I remember calling him. He said it was boring and he spent most of the time at the bar. In the bar, okay. <clears throat> let's okay and let's go for romantic because she mentioned that nothing else happened that night we talked then I said goodbye then next week I was sitting in the bar again and there he was oh and okay the next week he offered to buy me a meal <clears throat> I told them I had already eaten, um, and so we got chips and ate on the beach instead. Oh. When we said goodbye, he asked me to kiss him. <laughs> Romantic. Okay. All right, Simon. So she, uh, Hannah here, got married. Is that Hannah? I don't know. To Simon. Later on he uh, spent some time in Oxford and by coincidence sitting in a bar he met Hannah's sister who looked exactly like her. And well he might he might have thought that was a coincidence. But yeah, they had an affair and then her sister got pregnant. Later then, she somehow invited her sister to her home and the whole thing blew up. Okay, let's now go for blood. Okay. 
haven't bled before, do you need to take that few records? Mm, no, it's okay. Nothing like this has ever happened to me before. The blood. It's probably the worst thing that's ever happened to me. Mm hmm. She was sat behind him. She had my wig on. And she'd been there all day. And she had blood on her. And she was in shock. So her sister impersonated her and then killed Simon. She was wearing a wig. So they have had different hair. That could be why Simon did not suspect her. What the? Uh, no. Okay, thanks. Could I have ended it here? Why your mother did what she did. Okay. This is interesting. Do I understand why why I'll be waiting outside, log off and we can meet over the road. See? Okay, so that... I obviously did find all the clues that were necessary to clear it. So, it was a story about two sisters. They were separated uh, at their birth and then later they somehow met again they were playing around with their look alikeness and uh, eventually dating the same boy switching places and then Hannah broke the rules by sleeping with her boy Simon she got pregnant and soon after that, married Simon. So her sister had to leave. Hannah then had a miscarriage. Her baby died. And Simon then went to Oxford uh, on a conference somehow. And met Hannah's sister there fell in love with her, or at least had an affair, and Hannah's sister got pregnant. Hannah then invited her sister to live with her and Simon, because she was pregnant. And then when her and Simon saw each other, Hannah realized where the baby came from in the first place. A pregnant sister still don't know her name Eve maybe don't know impersonated Hannah to kill Simon so maybe Simon had to go because he was something that stood between the sisters 
something that disturbed harmony between them. So she killed him to remove that. For the baby, she said. Then both sisters worked together um, to cover up the murder so that the pregnant sister could escape with the baby. Simon and then the sisters instantly teamed up without having to say a word to cover it up make an alibi maybe teaming up at the police interview giving Eve or whoever the chance to escape to raise the baby the baby that the story is really about uh, Sarah her name it said is the daughter of Eve and she looked into that case because she wanted to understand why her mother killed her father because he stood in the way of being close to her sister again maybe because she because Hannah broke the rules in the first place some kind of revenge yeah well Something in between, that will be my answer. Yeah, not gonna play more. Think we uncovered the most stuff. You can give your own meaning to the story if you want, if you're not uh, satisfied with my explanation. So far, really awesome game. I'm kind of surprised that it ended that fast, and I'm sad that it is over. Really was awesome, really loved it. There should be more games like this. But yeah, really enjoyed it. I hope you had a little fun as well. If you did, leave a like. And I will be happy to see you in the next video. Thank you for watching, peeps. Have a nice one. Peace out. Maybe I just... Come on, no! What are you doing? Not stop. Do not stop. You have to run. It says run. It would be cool if it said run in the background. Not in the foreground. Uh, uh.